Hello everyone, I'm Max from Pushwush with another release notes episode. If you didn't have a chance to watch our previous episodes, I highly recommend you to do so on our YouTube channel. And today I have only one but a cool thing to show you. It's the next level for the iOS messages customization, our latest product update, iOS Live Activity Support. Hmm iOS Live activities are persistent interactive notifications displayed on the iPhone or iPad lock screen and in the dynamic island. They allow users to keep an eye on things in real time. These interactive notifications ensure that your vital updates won't be missed. Since they are persistent, you can display up-to-date content to your users without even having them unlock their phones. Let's dive into some real-world scenarios where live activities shine. Food delivery application, order status updates. Keep users informed about the status of their food orders and deliveries. Provide live updates on when their delicious meal will arrive. Taxi application, real-time taxi tracking. Eliminate the guessing game for users waiting for a ride. Display real-time information such as taxi will arrive in or taxi is waiting for you. Sports news application, live scoreboards. Engage sports enthusiasts with live scores that change as the game progresses. Make every moment of the match count with the dynamic score updates. Weather app, timely weather warnings. Ensure users stay prepared for changing weather conditions. Send notifications about upcoming rain showers, starting with a forecast and ending with a shiny outlook. Such timely updates were great for user experience and you may enjoy higher engagement with your application. To enable live activities and their code to your existing iOS widget extension, or create a new one if your app doesn't already have it. Follow the steps from the integration guide You'll find a link below. When it's done, you can manage live activities and update their content using the update live activity method of the Pushwish API. Some essential details to keep in mind when working with live activities. Live activities can be active up for eight hours until dismissed by the app or the user. If a live activity is not dismissed, it may be visible for an additional 4 hours on the device lock screen before it is automatically removed. An application must be opened to start a live activity. Live activities cannot be started remotely in response to a notification or a background task. An application can have 5 activities started at one time. You don't need to get user permission before sending live activities. However, it is recommended that the user opts in for the specific live activity while they are in the application. That's all for today, but please stay tuned for our next product releases and have a great day, everyone!